Well, I got nothing to say to you. Then leave. Not until I see Michael. You're the one who put Michael here. Yeah, now I'm doing my damnedest to get him out. Until you have paperwork to get Michael released, that's the day you can see Michael. Until then, stay the hell away from him. Come on. You got yourself sent to prison to protect Michael. I respect that, but you don't need to protect him from me. You betrayed him. Well, you want to hear it again? Fine. I blame myself for Michael getting locked up, and now I'm doing my damnedest to get him turned around and get him released. You're talking, you're talking to the wrong person. No, what are you talking See, about? You, come on. You want, you want Sonny to think that you care about your brother. Because if he buys it, you're back in. I know you might feel guilty, but now you're doing what you tried and failed to do the first time, and that's build a case against Sonny and get him convicted. Oh, wow. You just know everything, don't you? I know never to trust you again. Uh, no progress about getting you released. Um, but he's working on it, right? And they went through this whole carrying big brother routine last time he came to visit me. I told him to save his breath. Dad is going to get me out. No, oh, thanks for seeing him in my place. Yeah, I told Dante not to come back unless he's got the paperwork and get you released. Yeah, like that's going to happen. Dante's just putting on an act to score points with that. Okay, you, you have to understand. Sonny's always going to give Dante the benefit of the doubt because Dante is his son. Dad's connection. It used to kill me how quickly Dad just like gave in to this, this stranger he only knew like a few months before. And then he's going to make him the head of the organization. Did you think that Dad already knew that Dante was his son before he actually even knew it? Look, we know... We know Dante's a great liar. Yeah. Okay, he got Sonny to trust him, he got me to trust him. I didn't spot him as an undercover cop. Yeah, so he fooled you too. But it was different with Dad for some reason. Like he thought he was like him. He had things in common and things that Dad didn't see in me. I don't know, it's probably because I'm not his biological son. I don't know. Yeah, Sonny and I don't agree about Dante. No, you were smart. Once you knew the truth about Dante, you decide never to trust him again. Dad wants to. I kind of... I know this is hard for you to understand. But fathers feel a connection to their kids. No matter what their kids do, no matter how long it's been since they've seen them. Fathers love their children unconditionally. Gracious greetings. Uh, I, you've you've come through your incarceration unscathed. I mean, not. I mean, not that I would expect anything less. But you know, like Sam, Sam's worried about you. Huh? And now I, I can see why, because it looks like you haven't seen the light of day for for a long time. The jackal ventures out to the local grocer on almost a daily basis. To buy what? Orange soda and barbecue chips? Spinelli, you, you, have a, you have a business. Sam's working on all these cases. She can keep you busy. No, I have, I have no fear. The Jekyll is the Jekyll's engaged in meaningful enterprises. Online gaming? Online gaming is the virtual battleground in which the Jekyll holds his formidable skills, allowing him to accept missions that others would not dare to undertake. What mission? That was that was merely uh, that was mere, that was merely hypothetical. But I mean, if something really sensitive was to come up, then the jack did Carly come and see you? Who? Has she dragged you into one of her crazy plans? But they're not gonna do you any good. <laughs>